Right, so in this discussion board activity, what you need to do is uh, read the prompt, obviously, and then you're going to post a comment that's going to be a video comment, actually. And there is a couple ways to do it. Unfortunately, one way isn't working. Uh, so I'll, I'll show you which way isn't working, and then I'll show you how to do that correctly. So, <coughs> so if this is your first time to discussion board, uh, this is the prompt. Um, and then sometimes there will be multiple uh, forums, is what they call them, each having a different prompt. And so to get into a forum, what I do is I'm going to click on the title right there in the upper left. And then if I'm the first, there are no other threads here. Uh, so each, each time you create an original post, it's actually creating a thread, and then people can go in there and reply to the different threads. So if you do that, um, click on that. It's nice because that has a prompt up here, so you can read it as you type. And then this is a way that is not working, uh, but I, I'm assuming that it will work soon. I click on the webcam, that little teeny webcam icon, if you saw that. Um, and then from here, it asks you if you want to record from webcam. I say yes. Uh, if you haven't done this already, then it will ask you to connect to your YouTube account. And so that's, that's fairly easy to do. It just asks for some permissions, and then you can approve all that. And you just need your username and uh, password. And that is the same username and password uh, as your Google account that some of you may have created for the first time during this module or that you've owned for a while. So I'm just going to hit Start Recording. I want to allow. Uh, the webcam, okay. The the webcam uh, seems to be working out here, so I just hit close, and then I notice that it's already been recording for six seconds. As soon as I hit allowed, uh, as soon as I allowed it, it started recording. So I can hit stop recording, start over if I want to. Then you'll notice that it's it already started recording there. So here's the problem with this. I'm going to hit stop recording. I'm going to hit continue. Says, so do you want to embed it? I say yes. Insert. You give it a title. This is not going to work. And then I hit submit. And when I click on this, you'll notice that it has this frowny face. I don't know if that's a frown, but an unhappy face. And then it says YouTube is upgrading to a newer version, which is not supported by this device or app. So um, it looks like Core Sites is a little behind the times, and, and I think that Blackboard would be the same issue. So here's an easy workaround. I'm just going to go directly to YouTube. And if you're not signed in, you should see like a sign in button right here. So just click that and sign in again. It's the same. And that is a disturbing ad, so I'm going to close that. Uh, and, and it should um, prompt you to enter in your username and password, which again is the same username and password as uh, what you use to log into your Google Docs or Google Drive or, or your Google account. So what I want to do is I'm going to hit upload. And then it gives me some options here. Uh, I can just upload a video file that I already own. So that's one option is you could record a webcam video using um, a program on your computer, like Photo Booth or something like that. Um, or there's a nice little option here to uh, record directly from your webcam. So I'm going to do that. And then you'll notice this is the same as what I was looking at before. So I'm just going to hit Start Recording. I'm going to Allow hit close and you'll see as soon as I hit allow it started uh, counting uh, the, the recording so that I know that it, it automatically started which I don't want this to start when I wasn't ready so I'm gonna hit stop recording I'm going to hit uh, start over yes I do want to start over and this time I'm ready so as soon as this starts counting off I'm gonna start talking um, so one bit of advice for this is just speak naturally uh, be okay with mistakes. Some people um, feel like their video needs to be very polished, and so then they'll re-record and re-record until finally they're just frustrated enough where they're going to stop re-recording, and then they'll just live with the mistakes. Um, this is not text. In text, you can really polish your comments. In video, you're going to make mistakes, and everyone does that. And in fact, uh, one thing that I found is that it actually makes you seem more human. So be comfortable with run-on sentences or ums and ahs or inc uh, incomplete sen sentences or thoughts. That's totally fine. Um, see, I just said um, and I'm okay with that. <laughs> uh, just just speak naturally, and that's fine. It'll save you a lot of grief, and actually, I think your your comments better. So what I wouldn't do is read something or, or, or re-record it multiple times. Just be natural. Be human. You're, um, I, I, we can. That's one thing that we can all do. So then, what I'm going to do is I'm going to hit stop recording. And you'll see that it that was a one minute 
video, so I'm going to hit continue. And now it asks me if I want it to be public. What I typically do is I switch it to enlisted, and that's because I need to share it with other people, but I don't necessarily want it to go viral online. So by clicking unlisted, only those people that I share the link with can view it. It's kind of like an unlisted phone number. So it's unlisted in the, in the white pages, but if someone has that number, they could share it with other people and then they could contact you. So that's kind of the, the analogy that, that makes sense to me. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hit save changes. Then I'm gonna come up here and actually go to the video. So here's the video. I'm going to pause that and then underneath the video I should see something like share and then there is a nice embed option right here so I'm just going to copy this so control C or command C if you're on a Mac um, I'm going to go back to this page and because I already started this thread um, well let, let me just show you what it would look like from the start so I'm going to come here I'm going to create a new thread and this time I'm going to title this thread this will work I want to embed the, the video here. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to click on HTML. And then this creates a window. If you already have text in here, it can look, it's going to show you the HTML code, which is basically another language. What I typically do is just paste it at the top. Um, and I'm going to hit update. And you'll see that that is not my video. But what that is, is that's a plugin of my video. So what I need to actually do to preview it is I hit submit. And so at the top here, so if I click on that, you can see the video is embedded there and people can click on it and play. If something isn't right, then I can hit edit and then I can go in there and delete the video if I want to and hit submit. I'm actually going to delete both these comments because I'm done with them. So I'll just show you how to do that. So again, pretty simple. Hopefully this uh, tutorial was helpful for you. And if you do run into some technological problems, just let me know and I'd be happy to help. Thanks.